Proper Perspective. You see the shirt. You are tuned in to the Proper Perspective podcast. I am sick and tired of black men talking about abortion rights. I am sick and tired of black men standing with Republicans about being against abortion. At the end of the day, look, it's a woman's body. It's a woman's choice. If you so up in your feeling because somebody you impregnated got rid of that baby, grow up, find a woman that want to have a baby with you and move on with your life. Otherwise, y'all dudes need to shut up. You need to shut up quick. If you're going to be a Republican, if you're going to stand with Trump, but don't stand with Trump on some BS position. Jumping online, castigating black women for having abortions. It's her body. It's her choice. If you're so concerned with the babies, with the children, then why don't you get out there and adopt some children that need adopted? Why don't you get out there and feed some babies that need to be fed? Get out there, get out there, get out there and help some babies and help some children that need to be helped. The only time you got any, any, anything to say about it, if, 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 if the one woman that you impregnate, or if you were pimping a player out there in the two, three, four, and five that you impregnated, if, 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 if they want abortions, then you have a right to have an opinion, but you don't have a right to control what they do with it. You certainly don't have anything to say about it when it's just the masses of women who want to exercise that right. It ain't got nothing to do with you. If they choose to have an abortion because you ain't ready to be a father, because you 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 ain't solid enough to be a father, it's their choice, and that's on you. You should have came more correct to the table. But trying to force them to have a baby just so you can jump up and down and say, yeah, I'm against abortion. Shut the up. Ain't got nothing to do with you. But whether it gets restored or not, you know, that's a political decision or whatever. Whoever you vote for, it's clear who's for it and who's against it. So I got nothing to do with that. I'm just saying, I am tired. All these brothers who's supposed to be woke, conscious. If you really woke and conscious, and you would care about the babies that's here, here, here. They ain't made out the wound. It's a moot point. Show some attention to the ones that's here and need help. They need clothes. They need food. They need shelter. And you talking about the ones that didn't even make it out the womb. Didn't last in the womb long enough to even be more than a seed. Get over it. Get over it. Get over it. Shut up. Get on with your life. You over here belly aching because some woman you 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 impregnated a long time ago didn't want to have your child. Then you need to just make sure that in today's age, you on your grind enough when you do find somebody that get pregnant by you and he was on purpose, that they will move forward and have one but stop crying over spilled milk and trying to force everybody else into your own position all this talk all this energy towards women you don't know having children you ain't gonna never meet and you ain't gonna ever help it's ridiculous proper perspective you see the shirt you are tuned in to the proper perspective podcast